Good morning everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today I am filming my morning routine for you all. This is my typical routine now that I'm living at home and everything is online for me, especially uni. So I'll get up at about 7 o'clock, go on my phone. Firstly, I'll look at TikTok, have a nice scroll on there, have some funny laughs. There's always some good content on TikTok. If you guys want to follow me on TikTok, it is Monique Olivia, or one word, same spelling as my YouTube. Then after I'm finished scrolling on TikTok, I'll go on to Instagram, see what everyone's up to, look at stories. I'll typically do this for about 10 to 15 minutes, depending on what I have to do that day or how soon I have to get up. And if you guys haven't already, please check out my new Instagram. It's just Monique Olivia, same spelling as my YouTube. I've made a new one specifically for YouTube. So yeah, definitely check that out. So in the mornings, I will generally first thing make my bed just to get it out of the way and over and done with because having a messy bed for me is just such a nuisance, especially now that my room is pretty much where I spend most of my time. It's where I do my study, it's where I relax, it's where I sleep, it's where I do my makeup and get ready for the day. It's everything really at the moment now that I'm living at home. I'll also just do a quick clean of my room in general, just because I'm not the type of person to clean before I go to bed. If I'm being truly honest, I just can't be bothered. Then I will go and have a shower, just because I like to make sure that I get ready for the day, even though I'm gonna spend the whole day at home, just so I feel more productive and more ready for the day. Because if I stay in my pajamas, I, I just tend to really be super lazy. So yeah, shower time. Every time you return. So if you guys are wanting to know, the cleanser I'm using at the moment is the Cetaphil Oily Skin Cleanser. I love this cleanser, it does not make me break out and it doesn't dry out my skin which is great. And then for a body wash I'm just using the Dove Glowing body wash in the scent mango butter. It's really nice, it smells lovely too. Oh So today I've decided to wear some comfy gym clothes like I always do. I've decided to pair a cotton on long sleeve athletics top with one of my Gymshark sports bras, which this is one of my favorites, super comfortable. And I'm also wearing the Ignite leggings in black by White Fox. They're a part of the Sarah's Day collaboration. I stay waiting for you. Alright, now let's move on to skincare. My skincare is super simple, it just consists of me using the Cetaphil Moisturizing Lotion. I absolutely love this lotion, it's non-greasy, it sinks in really quickly and you only need a small amount and it'll go a long way. It's also suitable for people with sensitive skin. For deodorant at the moment, I'm just using the Dove Go Fresh Roll-On Deodorant. And for perfume, I'm using the Beyonce Heat. Smells amazing. Now time for breakfast. Yeah. So for breakfast, I typically have the exact same thing every single morning and that's poached eggs on toast. So I thought I'd show you guys exactly how I make it. So first thing, put the kettle on, boil that, put your pot on the stove and while I wait, I'll unload the dishwasher. Mm-hmm. 
So once the kettle's finished boiling, you're just gonna wanna pour all that water into the pot until you reach nearly to the top. Then I'm gonna add some white vinegar. I just put a quick dash in. Next, I will grab a small cup and a spoon with holes in it. I don't know the exact name for that. So you'll just crack an egg into the small glass, just so it's easy to transfer into the pot. Next, all you'll have to do is just do a light stir of the water and then plop your egg in. While that's cooking, grab a small bowl of cold water just so you can transfer your egg once it's finished cooking into the cold water to stop the cooking. Damn, she's looking fine. So now we're gonna have to move on to the second egg. So just do the exact same thing with the first and plop the second one in. While that second egg is cooking, put your toast in the toaster because roughly when the toast is done, your second egg will be finished. Now it's time to move on to the most important part of the morning, which is coffee. At the moment, I've been liking using the Nescafe mocha sachets. All I do is fill the cup three quarters of the way with hot water and then do one quarter almond milk. Now the toast is done, it is time to butter it and I'm using the Nutilex Original Butter. I absolutely love this butter, it's very nice and it is dairy free. Alright, now the most important part with the poached eggs, you've got to dry them. So I just use a paper towel or you could just use a normal dish towel and just dry off your egg. Because you don't want to make your bread all soggy and wet. So this is crucial if you want to have nice poached eggs. Now that I've got my breakfast and my coffee, all I'm just going to do is sit down and watch some YouTube while I have my brekkie. <laughs> That's just me saying it's so good because it was. And yeah, so now I'll just relax, eat my breakfast, and once I'm done, then I'll start doing my uni work or whatever it is I have to do for that day. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I can't wait to see you in my next one. If you liked it, don't forget to hit the thumbs up and subscribe if you're new to my channel. Hope you guys have a lovely day. Love you guys. Bye.